Hello everybody, my name is Ponestab and welcome back to a story about my uncle. And we are so close to the end, I feel like. All the flares are closer together, the fires are still hot, the game's getting insanely hard. I think we're about to find our uncle. And I am going to die. Yep. Not close enough to hit that. No. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Did I just find a bug? Can I scale the side of this and survive? Can I make it back? I'm just wasting time. Kill me! Okay, there we go. I was right at the end of it. Alright, so we gotta go up. No, oh, fuck my ass. Banged into the fucking wall again. This game is so fun, though. Oh my goodness. Pop it here. There. Fucking hit our face and die! Alright, I gotta not use the boost for the second one. Fuck me! I didn't need to do this. Can I use the forward momentum? Oh, no, no I can't. I gotta use the boost over there. We got this. We can totally do this. Death! Pabushi! And then boost it over. How is that still not enough? It was. D don't ask me. I'm just playing the game. Beneath the ice, you could still see signs of what this place had once been. Something not unlike the caves where the village lay. The ice age must have come suddenly, washing over it like a freezing tsunami. Now it lay desolated. Haunting anyone who dared visit with falling stalactites, sharp icicles, and its bottomless depths. I can probably grapple to those. Yeah. Where was it I was going? Down here. Death. That is a ball of death. Where am I going from here, though? Can I go that way? Can I go up? I don't think so. Is it over here? Yeah. Okay. Holy shit! Yeah, I gotta jump up on that. Oh no, down there! Down there! Not so bad. Not so bad. I think that's where I need to go, too. Is that a glider? Can I use this? Oh, just let me use it. It'd be so great. <laughs> it's frozen in the ice. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> Let's go. This is probably the most fun Let's Play that I've done. And it's just only in terms of playing it because I'm enjoying it so much. I have no idea how the community is taking it. Uh, I think I've only put two up so far. They haven't done phenomenally well, but they haven't done horrible. So I'm not sure. They also haven't been up but for maybe a day. I couldn't hit any of those. <laughs> they were so close. <laughs> Alright, it's fine. Wow. 
Two. Oop. I gotta not use the the rocket boots there, but I don't know how not to. Cause that's really high up. Oh, I missed it. Son of a bitch. I thought I had that. <laughs> oh, I thought I had it. Okay. Alright, so we hit it there. Hit our head. Go there. Hit that. Here. Here. And then there. Okay, see? Nailed it! the fuck was that? What was I thinking? Come on, buddy. Away! And I should be able to just tether to here. What if I straight just jumped up? Yeah, see, that was fine. More flares. See, they're so close together now. Those fall really fast. Holy shit. There was nothing for me to hold on to. Just fly over! No, see, that's so far to go. I saved it and I didn't mean to save it. So you can hear the little weep, 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 weep when I miss something. Oh, it hit me. It just fucked everything! See, even if you're looking straight up, if you're falling with enough momentum, it doesn't matter. Alright. We're fine. Everything's fine. I feel like that meme of the dog. This is fine. This is all fine. <laughs> <laughs> Landed! Fucking nailed it! Alright, now I gotta go that way. Got it! Gone the wrong way! I've made a grave mistake. Can I land on this? Oh, come on, man. I had all my tethers. Because I landed. I didn't even take that into account. Come on, buddy. Just reach one of them. <laughs> We've been through so much together. Alright, here. Here. Hit that. Here. Oh, shit. Here. Hit that. Nope. We might be able to just make it. <laughs> okay. Come on, let's get some pizzazz with it. I said get some pizzazz with it. Come on, buddy. Do it like you mean it. Oh, that's right. I used the fucking boost already. I'm the worst. Just land up there. See, no. I just pulled myself into it. Alright. Slowly. Like we were talking about last episode. Slowly, calmly, dead, again, okay. Up, pull over, pull down, we're there. Now, we can pull here, hit this, pull here, pull here, 
Hit this. Go there. Land here. Get everything back. We got our boots back. We got our, our footing. Okay. Hit here. Hit here. Hit that. Hit here. Hit here. Hit that. Hit here. Hit there! Hit there. Hit that. Hit here. No, hit that one. I thought I landed on it. I'm getting so lost. I'm not sure what's causing it. I forgot there was one in chapter two. <laughs> right here. And then hit the wall, drop down there. Okay. So we hit here. Swing our way over. Hit that. So we hit this one. And this one. Hit that one. Hit this one. Pull down over there. Land. Okay. Now I can hit this one. Get some momentum. Hit this one. Hit that. Hit this one. Shit. Lose momentum. There's nowhere to land but on this. Where the fuck am I? Oh, I'm on it, just inside. Okay. Now then. I'm supposed to be going that way. Okay. And then down here! Alright, so again, by mistake, we've made it. Can you please? Dude, it's right there! That was like our best try so far. Come on, buddy. Come on! Land, get everything back. How did I miss? No, no, no. I, I, I fudged it all up. I fudged it all. There, hit here, hit this one, pull yourself down that way. Come here, you gotta get yourself together, buddy. Come on. Alright, now that's the closest one. So hit it here up at the top. So we get optimum distance. And I didn't hit another refill again. You gotta refill your grapple. If you don't, it's pointless. Just fall to your death every time. Okay, so hit this one, hit this one, refill, hit that one, hit that one, pull down, done. Okay, hit this one, hit this one, refill, refill, hit this one, hit this one. Refill. Pull yourself down! Oh! Shit! Okay. Pull yourself over. Pull yourself over. Refill. Hit this one. This one. Refill. Pull here. Pull here. Pull there! Phone, shut up! I was so close. Oh my goodness. Alright. Got down to a pattern. Goodness. I follow so many people on Twitch. That's, that's the platform I used to use. And so all the time, 
My phone's just like, hey, did you know somebody you haven't watched for six months is live? Thank you, phone. You're very sweet. I appreciate the help that you give me. I do. Refill. Please hit that. Refill. Hit these guys. Pull yourself down over here. All right. It's always this one. This one is my. This is my bane now. Fuck. Just salvage it somehow. As long as I get high enough, yes. To pull For myself down. I don't care. Long too. I took some comfort in knowing that whatever problems I face now, Fred would have faced them too. And beaten them. If he could do it, I could do it too. Damn straight. Wrong! That was <laughs> so wrong! Come on, buddy. Get it together. One good jump. No, I gotta use the rocket boost. Okay. Now get me here. Oh, it was supposed to get me over there. Okay. I'm retarded. Ignore me. I use that loosely, by the way. If I offended anybody, I do apologize. It was not my intent. And you can flame me about it in the comments. I'm an idiot! Alright. I could probably just rocket boost over here. Cut out the middleman. Okay, see, now we're doing it right. Ooh, what's over there? Oh, what is this? That's probably the secret over there. Yeah, it's probably the secret. I'm not worried about the secret, guys. I'm just, I'm sorry I'm not, like I said before. Any time that I've gotten one of the secrets has been an unintentional just because I liked the area maybe that it was in. Or I heard it and it was right next to me or, you know, anything like that. What about over there? See, I want to be over there, it looks like. I just pulled myself over. Come on, buddy. There we go. Get yourself down there. There's another flare. Fred, we're so close. I can I taste the friendship. I messed that up. There we go. There. This is getting tense. Can you feel it at home? That wasn't so bad. That was not so bad. This is probably not going to be so great, though. We're going that way. We're going that way. Fred, which way did you go? Alright, I'm just gonna jump it that way and see what happens. This was a mistake. Maybe not. Yeah, this was a mistake. Yeah, I gotta swing down underneath all that. Okay. Which means, let's get on this. See, I gotta get to the underneath. Oh shit. 
So let's just get there. I can't tether to any of that, though. Oh, I saw it! Fred, you are so cool. I just want to point that out while I can. Dude has got balls of steel. Because this is terrifying. I hit a checkpoint. I heard it. Yeah, right here. Okay, see, I was just still clambering around up there. I didn't need to be there anymore. I could have dropped down. I fucked up. Saved it. Okay. We're good. Then we get over there. Then we get up here. I know I said it in the last one, but I think this may be the last episode. Here's another flare. It was dark all around me. But there was a light at the end of the tunnel. Oh, is it you? Fred, is it you? I can't jump anymore. It's a person! <gasps> Fred! Hello? Nephew. Uncle Fred, I finally yeah! found him. My little boy, I'm glad to see you. Ah! Wearing the suit I made you. I told you you made it for us. I said that I found the suit in his workshop, and that I came looking for him. I'm sorry for being away for so long. What's up with his hand? I'm busy down here, you see. The frog people. That was an experiment of mine. Do you remember the eggs I found before? I sent them here by accident, and I had to follow. By the time I got here, they were already growing. These caves were empty before, but my experiment has made them full of life. I've conducted research on them and documented everything about them. And I built a new crystal-powered pad to be able to get back to my colleagues, show them how fantastic this all is. I interrupted Fred and told him about Maddie, how we came all the way to Starhaven together, and that I had promised to ask him if he would go see her there. Madam, my little Maddie. Your little Maddie. I should have taken her to see Starhaven long ago. She was always so curious about the strays. Well, I left her. I wanted to protect her. Or rather, protect myself from losing her. I have changed my mind. I'm not going home. What does research or praise matter? What? You can be here with these creatures. They need you. What are you talking about? And it's just as well. I don't trust this pad for more than one ride anyway. You need that ride. I didn't want to go home. No! And I asked if I could stay with him and Maddie instead. I'm sorry, nephew. As much as I enjoy having you here, you must go home. Explore the world on your own. Have your own adventures. I reluctantly agreed to go home. No! I'm no. going to miss my uncle. That is so cool. But I'm sure you'll do phenomenal on your own. I agree. Look at what we did. Don't worry about me or Maddie. You'll be fine. The pad is yours, boy. When you're ready. I don't want to go. Give him a hug. Give him all the hugs. Oh, it's just like a kitchen glove or a gardening glove with the fingers cut out. Do I have to go? You look creepy up close. What's with your eyes? Holy shit, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I love you. Fucking weirdo, but God. That was insanely good! Oh my goodness. So let's just recap here. Okay. 
Uncle goes missing. We're gonna go find him. So we run out there to his house, check it out. There's a suit there, the same one that he uses, that fits us. So we pop that shit on, and we just jump on his trash compactor pad, and get jettisoned into space, into some kind of weird, interdimensional, didn't suffocate on the way there style like, atmospheric craziness. Then we get there, and we do crazy awesome stuff. And on our journey, we run into these species of people that are frog people. And I didn't put two and two together. That the frog people, and we found frog eggs, I thought that he used the DNA for the suits, and that's why I could jump so high and you take all the impact and everything like that. Because I thought, in my head, you know, frog skin's pretty rubbery. Well, you know, why not? I think it is. It looks rubbery. It's all weird. I don't know. <laughs> so I, that's where my head is the entire time. Turns out, he created this entire ecosystem of crazy, awesome, just frog people. And we've got one group D who are just... No. Good night, sweetie. Wait, Dad. Does that mean Fred is still there? Who knows? That was the last time I saw him. Don't you miss him? I do, sometimes. But I don't worry about him. Because I know that wherever he is, he's on his biggest adventure yet. That is so cool. Am I back at his house? All right, we're going to talk a little bit first. So I didn't take into account that, that that entire species and their ecosystem and everything was driven by his creation. That didn't even cross my mind. So you guys took me by surprise with that because that was awesome. Uh, fucking... Were you giving me mechanics and taking mechanics away to make the game harder and you have to do things differently in some spots? That was great! Now, I realized that in the main menu, you have an option where you can do time trials, where you can speed run this game. I'm not going to do that because I'm terrible at it to begin with. And to be honest, the mouse and keyboard was a lot easier than with the gamepad. Because the gamepad, even with the sensitivity, like, I turned it all the way up for this final episode. And it's still, even being this quick, is too slow. It's way too slow for the snap looking that you have to have. Holy shit. Well, let's explore his house a little bit. I would assume that this is our house now. I would, I would think that this is us now. Dear Fred, today I step into the lobby of your house for the last time. It's all packed My up. My daughter asked me to tell her about an adventure, and I came to think of you. Your house so looks sad. just like my mother and I left it years ago. After you'd gone, I was sure she was going to throw out all your stuff. But she just cleaned up. We made you a small memorial. So sad. I'm more sad than I wanted to be at the end of this game. See you in another life, brother. Your brother. It's not the Titanic, is it? No. Okay, we're good. I mean, look at all the places he went. All the shit he did. The, Lap the Galapagos Islands? Like, wow. Holy shit. Do we get to keep the suit? For a while, I came here every day. Ooh. Just like I used to. Sometimes... I could even faintly hear your voice calling from the observatory, asking me to get you this tool or that. Can I write on the board? Grab it! I'm drawing dicks. I never told my mother about that day. I don't think she would have believed me. So boxed Can up? I believe it. After all these years. Can I get the suit? Is that for me? I mean, what is everybody's reaction when they find these giant sliding storm doors? And the giant sp interdimensional space trash compactor. That's all covered in snow now. It's an actual cutscene. Holy shit.
It's gonna be a long video. I'm sorry, guys. I am. Oh no, I wanted to read that. Uncle Fred, thanks to you, I have found an even greater adventure. Thank you. Oh, okay, we're just following the... Your nephew. Oh, see, after that adventure, his greatest adventure is being a dad. That's so sweet. I'm sad he never came back. This game was awesome. This game was incredibly awesome. A hundred percent, guys. Ten out of ten. Even with the, the mechanics being kind of ass to me. It was all a user malfunction. It didn't have anything to do with how they reset. This game was absolutely incredible. Like I said, I picked it up for a buck. And that's got to be the best dollar I've spent all year. That was absolutely incredible. If you guys like platformers, if you've enjoyed this playthrough, seriously, think about picking it up. Because it's a hell of a game. It is an absolute hell of a game. But I'm going to end this one here, guys. Thank you so very much for being here. I appreciate every moment of it. You guys have a wonderful day, evening, night, wherever you may be. And I will see each and every one of you in the next video. Bye. And slap that like button if you enjoyed it. Yeah. A little uh, for a minute there. You're welcome. All right. Bye, guys.